Hi guys, welcome back. If you're new, my name is Shelby and welcome. So today's video is my March, right? January, February, March. March BoxyCharm unboxing. So there's some really good products and then there's a major dud. So if you want to see what those products are, then let's just get right into this. So on the card this month, it says vacation. I wish I was on a vacation right now. Ugh. So the first thing that I see when I pull out of the box, this is the South Main Man, South Man, I don't know, three eye gel packs. It's supposed to reduce puffiness, reduce dark circles, and moisturize the eye area. And they come with three in a pack. This retails for $10. So you get three for $10. And then these are what the little packs look like so they're all individually wrapped unfortunately I am NOT going to be testing these out on camera for you guys um, just because I already did part of my makeup so I'm actually gonna test these out probably later tonight and then I will let you guys know either on the screen or below in the description box what I think of them and pretty much on the back it says thoroughly cleanse the eye area apply this product under the eye leave on for 30 minutes to reduce puffiness and dark circles use promptly after opening for best results, use for three consecutive days. And the next thing in the box, this is the Pretty Vulgar Make Them Blush, and it's in the shade Hush Blush. This is the cutest packaging ever in this color. Oh, so pretty. It's not even showing up on camera for you guys. Maybe if I hold it back here. There you go. I'm pretty sure this is a high-end brand. Yeah, so this retails for $26. It's supposed to just be a natural glowy flush to your cheeks. It's silky smooth, long wearing, and highly pigmented. Dip in here a few times. Don't know how pigmented these are. Tap off the excess and let's see. Wow. They weren't lying when they said highly pigmented. I like to just apply it right here on my apple and then drag it backwards just a little bit. I go in with very light strokes like I'm barely touching my skin right now. I absolutely love this color. I love that it's matte. No shimmer is in it at all so it's not going to emphasize your texture. I love this packaging. It's adorable. I actually really think this is worth it. I'm obsessed with this beautiful color. The next thing in the box is a set of brushes. So this is the Vintage Cosmetic Smoky Eye Brush Set. So it comes with three little brushes. That's the packaging. So cute. And this retails for $23.15. comes with a shadow brush, an angled shadow brush, and a smudger brush. They all come individually wrapped, which is nice. So this is the first brush, and this says step one for the money. And then this says step two for the shadow, and this is the angled shadow brush. And then this one says step three, go girl go, and this is the smudger brush. So they feel pretty soft. They're a little dense for my liking. I like really fluffy brushes, so I will test these out today, see if they're really good, and I'm going to use them with this BoxyCharm Impure palette. So BoxyCharm Impure, I'm guessing, collab together to create an eyeshadow palette. And that's what that looks like. Beautiful colors, a mix of some mattes and then some shimmers right here in the center. So we're going to use this today as well. And this palette retails for $36. I'm just going to do more of like a pink smoky eye, I guess. We're going to go in with Nakey right here. So that color blended out really nicely, cute orange tone. So I'm going to take the step two angled brush from the brush set from BoxyCharm and I'm just going to take this dark purple right here. And I'm going to take the regular shadow brush, the step one, and I'm going to go in with this chocolate shade right here. This eye look is going downhill. Oh boy. No. 
they don't want to blend they really don't like this dark brown black will not blend I can't make this palette work I'm really sorry guys but I mean the shimmers don't even want to stay on my eye they're like flaking off and then the mattes don't even want to blend so honestly I think this is a total dud I don't know what happened with this palette I don't know how people are making this work, but the mattes feel really chalky. They don't want to blend. This eye look just looks a mess. So I'm going to go ahead and take it all off. I'm just going to not even bother with this anymore because I just really can't get it to work, even the shimmer shades. Besides that, there is one thing left, and this is the Butter London Double Decker Lashes Mascara. This is gigantic. Oh my goodness. This retails for $20. And it says get 200% thicker, thicker lashes in just one coat and a 314% increase in, increase in lash curl. This is what the gigantic mascara looks like. And then the wand is also huge. Kind of reminds me of the Too Faced Better Than Sex in a way, but that is huge I really like this mascara so far grabs the lashes pulls them up separates them doesn't make them look really spidery and clumpy so I really like this I totally think that mascara is worth $20 I like the way it made my lashes look not too spidery and just really nicely coated. The overall total of this month's box is $115.15. It's a ton of money for the price of the box. That's such a good steal, although I did not like this eyeshadow palette at all. I will definitely let you guys know about the eye patches. So, the brushes were alright. I couldn't really tell if I liked them or not. I only used two out of the three because I was getting so frustrated with the eyeshadows. But, so far I kind of like them. I mean, I didn't really get a full review of them, but they seem pretty nice for the price. I hope you enjoyed this month's BoxyCharm unboxing, even though there was only one major dud. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button if you are not already, and hit that bell button next to it to be notified every time I upload. And I will catch you guys in my next video. Bye, loves.